it is 2026. Learning about AI is no longer optional. You need to learn about different AI tools and how to get the most out of them to optimize and make your life easier. There are many platforms online that promise to teach you about different AI tools and teach you everything you need to know about AI. Today, we're going to be looking at Corsive, which is slightly different than other learning platforms I've used because it optimizes a 15 minute a day lesson on a different AI tool so you can like learn a broad range of AI tools that exist. To be clear, this isn't an in-depth dive into each tool. So if you are a master already, probably not for you. However, if you're starting out and you have a bare bone basic like no understanding of AI, it's pretty good because the lessons and tutorials are simple and easy to follow and it covers a large range from a beginner perspective. There are a couple important things, so please watch to the end of this video so you ensure that you're getting the most out of this tool. And if you enjoy AI, don't forget to subscribe because it's completely free and I cover AI on a daily basis. Can you get this information elsewhere? Yes, most definitely you can, but Corsev makes it extremely easy because it's in a time constraint, easy to follow guide. So you don't have to like go online and say, hey, what am I need to learn today? What should I Google search or what should I look up online? It's all here. So it's very easy and you can see how it works, how it looks. And this is our lesson. So we can actually like open a playground and we can start filling in the gap so we can type in a prompt. So you are a social media expert for an eco-friendly brand, generate three post ideas for posting on social media. We can hit check and we can see exactly how it works. Course of really helps people focus on a specific task on any given day. And you can see if you get it wrong, it gives you an incorrect answer and you can go from there. So if you want to get caught up and you want to learn about ChatGPT, Gemini, Midjourney, so on and so forth, it's a pretty good tool just to get a bare bone basic understanding of each tool. And again, it is structured in a way that is 15 minutes a day. So at the top here, we can go to challenges and you can see different challenges that exist. So there's like this 28 day challenge and you can go through and learn something new each and every day. And honestly, some of these tools I have not tried myself and I try to cover different tools every day on the channel here just to kind of keep you up to date as well. But these are more like interactive lessons. So you can see the daily challenges here. There are all sorts of different challenges you can do. So say you want like the no code challenge and you want to learn how to code, but without coding, you can see here they go through all these different no code challenges for you. And just like any other, you can just hit start and we can start learning this challenge and we can start learning about this tool and then that is just challenges we can also go to guides and under guides we can actually see and learn about any individual tool so we can like click here and we can see and learn lessons about anything we want so if we want to go deeper into just claude we can do that or dolly we can do that as well and if we go back there's also like this whole recommended for you so there's like ai for business and boost your sales with ai so on and so forth and lastly at the top there's something called ai tools when you're on ai tools you have all these different models you can access so we have like ChatGPT mini stable diffusion gemini claw dolly so on and so forth However, if you hit like create an image, for example, it has to be stable diffusion. Gemini on this version does not allow you to create images, so only stable diffusion. So say we said like a cat holding a subscribe button, and then we can pick out our style. So maybe we want cyberpunk, we can hit settings. We can say, okay, what size, what size do we want? Do we want square, landscape, portrait, story, so on and so forth. So let's hit landscape and let's do a count of four. Let's hit apply settings, and now we can hit submit or generate and it's going to generate those for us you can also give advice generate ideas analyze data so on and so forth this is all built in however Corsev, when i reached out and i said hey what is the usage they did not want to share how much usage you actually get per month with your subscription so you can actually see here what this looks like and we can see hey it's pretty good we can go back if we want and we can just create a brand new conversation and do this all over again. But them not being transparent about how much usage the AI tool section gives you isn't the greatest. So if you're using this just for the AI tool section, 
be wary because they aren't sharing how much you can actually use it. And that is one of two problems I found with this tool with Corsa. And we're going to cover the second one in a second. Let me just cover a couple other features and then we will get there. So they have all these different certificates you can put on your like LinkedIn profile or resume or wherever you want to put it. You notice they also have something called prompt library and they have all these different prompts that you can just quickly use, which is kind of cool. However, if you click one, like these web development no code prompts, for example, you see all these different prompts and it's like, okay, this is great. Let's look at this workflow automation prompt. And then you get hit with this paywall that you have to pay $50 extra above and beyond your monthly subscription to get access to all the prompts. And to be clear, that is not the other problem I was talking about. There is one other. Let's get to the second negative point, which is be weary of their subscription and their subscription model. So the first one I talked about was the transparency of not sharing how many tokens, how much AI usage you get out of their tools section. They wouldn't share that. The second one is some of the reviews that I've been reading about Corsev on Trustpilot and other YouTubers and Google Play. So if you scroll down and you can see Trustpilot, they have a lot of five-star reviews, four-star reviews, and they have a very few number of one-star reviews. However, all the one-star reviews have something in common. So it is mostly people talking about it being a subscription. So it's not a one-time payment. It is a subscription for four weeks. So you can see I got an offer for four weeks. It said four weeks. I was unaware I was buying a subscription. You can see here as well, this person mentioned that they tried to charge them on PayPal. Well, of course, because it is indeed a subscription. On another YouTube channel, I was reading some comments. They billed me for renewal and I contacted them immediately and they refused to refund. And you can keep reading the comments here. And then if we come to Google Play and we scroll down, we can kind of see the same general idea. So they sell additional services with confusing advertising. And I said I didn't want the package. No reimbursement can be done. Refuse to refund. Now the question is, is it worth it? And it's a tricky one to answer, especially given the couple of reviews I've read about that. Like I said, there's a lot of reviews that are indeed positive, but a couple of those reviews I just want to point out to be super transparent in terms of what you get with this package. And part of what I read was if you're using PayPal or you're buying through the Google Play Store, you can totally cancel your like subscription service. PayPal, someone's won the, the charge and they got back their money. Just to be clear, I think Google Play is probably your best bet because you can quickly cancel the subscription in one location. So with that said, and that kind of like out of the way, and again, it's a small subset of users that I've read and I don't want to like mislead you in any way. I just want to point it out just to be on the safe side because I try to research all of these tools before I demonstrate and show them off to you just so you understand exactly what you're getting. And I try to be as transparent, as fair and clear as possible. So hopefully that helps a little bit. But is this tool worth it? And the answer is it really depends. Are you a power user? that has like a really good knowledge of like AI tools in general, and you watch videos like myself on a daily basis, then probably not. You're not going to get a lot out of this tool. If you're a user that is brand new starting out and you have no baseline and you don't want to watch myself that covers AI tools on a daily basis, then probably Corsev is a good option for you because it breaks down tools each and every day, a different tool every day, and they're really easy to use, easy to understand, little mini course. And again, it is for like bare bone basic learning, someone who's brand new and just wants to learn the bare bone basics. Like, hey, it's 2026, I'm gonna like start learning finally, and you don't wanna watch videos, and you want something interactive, bite size every day, Corsev is a pretty good option, but just be wary, make sure you're using like Google Play or PayPal when you're signing up. As always, leave a comment down below. Let me know what your thoughts are on this one. I've covered a couple of these like learning tools over the last few days. If you're a bare bone basic user, this is a great tool for you. If you're like super, super advanced and you want to go like way further, check out the video from yesterday. And if you 
just enjoy AI and you want to stay up to date and learn about new tools and different things that are happening in the world of AI, just subscribe to the channel because I cover AI on a daily basis. Don't forget to like the video. It tells all of them, hey, enjoy this type of content. I want to see more of it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time in another video. AI tools, AI news, AI prompts you can use. It's all for free. Just come and see at FranklinAI.com where you're meant to be.